So you might be trying to figure out how you can screenshot on your M2 Pro MacBook Pro. Now doing this is actually very, very basic, but there's a few different ways to do it. One of the easier ways to do it is to actually screenshot via your QuickTime player. So if you go and click on the top left or top right up here and you just type in QuickTime, most of the time if you just type in Quick, it usually comes up. So go and open up your QuickTime player like this. And all you wanna do is click on the file on the top left now, if you go and click on new screen recording, what you can do is you can go ahead and pretty much just go ahead and click on this little option over here. And it actually allows you to go ahead and capture selected you know, portion. And if you click on these three options right here, you can actually go ahead and take a you know actual screenshot of that specific image. So you can go and you know capture your entire screen, you can capture your entire window, or you can go and capture your selected portion. And whenever you're ready, you can go and kind of maneuver this down or up, depending on what you want to screenshot, you can click capture and it will go ahead and take that screenshot for you. So that is a kind of easy way to do it, but I hate doing it this way. So the way I normally do it, and you can save it from here, the way I normally do it is I use three buttons. I use the command button, the shift button, and the four button at the same time. So I will go and demonstrate one more time. So essentially I will hold down the command button right here, the shift button, and I will click on the four button at the same time. Now you will see that the mouse cursor just automatically changed. And from here, what you can do is you can go ahead and kind of drag on the window and screenshot exactly what you want. So you can see it just took that screenshot. Now you can also do command, shift, and five, and that will go ahead and open up that same thing we just opened up before. And you can go and select and you can capture from here. You can also do command, shift, and three, and that will automatically take a screenshot of the whole entire window. So you can see on the bottom right exactly what I'm doing. And that is pretty much it. Typically the way I screenshot is command, shift, and four. But you can also do command, shift, and three. You can also do command, shift, and five if you want to, if you want to do that way. But that's pretty much how it's done. If you have any other thoughts or questions, then let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out to the